Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Livia and today I'm going to be showing you what I got for my 15th birthday. I'm super excited to make this video because I love doing hauls and I know you guys love to watch them. So without further ado, let's just get started. First, I'm going to start with some cards and like, my great grandmother got me this cute one with a cat and then she also gave me some cash. Same with my uncle, this one says niece. My grandma got me this and she also got me some cash as well as a Starbucks gift card. Along with that, she also did get me some pajamas, but they're in the wash right now or I would show them to you. And then my mom got me this Hello Kitty card and then she's taking me shopping in New York City, which I'm so excited for. That's kind of cards and gift cards haul. So now I'm going to get started showing you the actual items. I'm going to start off with this little guy. Her name is Pebbles. I named her that and my best friend got this for me. Penguins are one of my favorite animals, so whenever she got me this, I was so excited. She's super soft and I cuddle her every single night. I absolutely love her, so thank you so much to my best friend. Also for my best friend, she got me this little Hello Kitty mug, as well as made me this pretty paper flowers. They're absolutely beautiful and she's so talented with making things like this. I've tried, but I'm not good at like being super sweet and I love the homemade flowers. They're absolutely beautiful. Then also from her, she got me this little like thing. I have not put the sticks in yet. I haven't opened it or I'm going to today. I just haven't gotten around to it yet, but it's super cute. It's even really pretty looking and it smells rather vanilla-y. It smells like the one Dior perfume. I don't remember which one, but it's the one that I want. I don't actually remember what it's called, but it's the Miss Dior one. I know there's different variations, but I'm not sure which one it was. But yeah, I absolutely love this and it smells so good. I can't wait to put these in it and my whole room is just going to smell like vanilla. She then wrote me the lyrics to 15 by Taylor Swift on this little card and put a little bow on the bottom. If you know me or you see my channel or even if you look around in my room, you know that I absolutely love bows. So I thought that was a really cute touch. She also made me this super cute little homemade birthday card and it has little balloons. It's really adorable. I absolutely love it. This card is so sweet and I literally read it every time I see it. It's sitting on my desk and every time I'm like, oh, there's my card, I read it. It has the sweetest message inside. It's just so amazing. My best friend did quite the birthday haul for me this year. She also got me some candy, but I ate it. Then lastly, what she got me, which is like the most exciting in my opinion, is here, let me go grab it. I actually forgot to get it. This is just a few of the things from the box. I don't know where the other ones are. They're around my room somewhere. But oh my goodness, if you've never watched me before, you probably don't know this, but I'm a huge New Jeans fan. New Jeans is a K-pop group, and my favorite idol from them is Heron. I just really like her vocals, and like, she's so nice. My best friend got me the new Supernatural limited box, and she happened to get the Heron version. You don't even get to choose which version you want, but I got the Heron one, which is green. It came with this cute little bag. The strap is really long, and I actually brought this on my vacation, and I packed my snacks in it. Along with that, it came with some postcards. Here's one of them. It's a close-up of Heron. Here's another postcard with the group of five. And then it came with a cute little photo book. It has a bunch of pictures of Heron in here. And I'll show you which one's my favorite spread. This is the one that I have it open to sitting on my dresser. I just think that this is so pretty. And she looks really good in this picture. I just love this spread. I'm actually so happy that my best friend got me this because I love decorating my room and new jeans things. And now I have even more stuff. Then it came with some little photo cards. Let's take them out. We have ones of Heron. Then on the back, they have a bunch of quotes in Korean, but I do not know how to read Korean. One of them has a little kitty on it. And then lastly, it came with a little CD and this is the Heron version, so it's green. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. I'm actually so happy that she got me this. This is one of my favorite things that I've ever received from anyone. So yeah, thank you so much to her. This was so, so nice. Next up, my parents got me an ear piercing. <laughs> like, they paid my piercing. I got my second, um, like, ear there, if you can see it. And I really like it. It's super duper cute, and I've been wanting it for a really long time. I did not know that piercings were that expensive, but I'm glad that they paid for it, because I probably wouldn't have gotten it if I had to pay for it. Along with my ear piercing, they also got me this really cute Kate Spade bag that I've been wanting for a really long time. Um, Kate Spade is, like, nice bags and I don't really have like a purse so I really like this I love the color and I love the black accents it's so so cute this is my thing ever I absolutely love this bag next up I think I'm gonna show you guys the things that I got from Sephora I did pay for these myself and using some of my birthday money every year I like to treat myself to a bunch of gifts around my birthday just because I think that um you birth also a time to acknowledge yourself and like gift yourself I just don't birthdays so I think that everyone should like celebrate their birthday to the fullest and that's what i do every single year 
I'm gonna give you a little haul of what I got from that what I got at Sephora. A lot of these are refills of things that I already had, but some of them are new. First thing I got is the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid. I actually haven't had this before, but I've been using it for a couple weeks now, and it's really good. I feel like my skin is a lot more moisturized. I'm gonna change the angle. I feel like the lighting's... Actually, it's kind of worse over here. There we go. That works a bit better. Like I said, I've been using this serum for a while now, and I do really like it. I feel like it really moisturizes your skin. Next up, I got the face wash combo. I got these in the mini sizes because I've never tried them before. This is from the Silwasu and it's the cleansing oil as well as the cleansing foam. I really like these and I will definitely be repurchasing them probably in the full size whenever I run out. Then I went ahead and got the Innisfree sunscreen. I've been wanting this for a really long time. I've been using the one from Hero, like the pimple patch brand, but I wanted to switch to get Innisfree. I really like Korean brands, especially Korean sunscreen. I used to have the Joseon one, but I ran out a while ago. And the lighting here, it's kind of hard to see, but as if you can, it is like a greenish tint. And whenever you rub it in, it like cancels out redness in your skin. I don't know if you can really see it on my hand, but it does look moisturized and like less reddish, I guess. I don't really know. Next thing I got was the Rare Beauty setting spray. I got their mini one a while ago and I really liked it so I went ahead and got the full size. I use this every single day to set my makeup and I find that it works really well. Also from Rare Beauty, I got their under eye brightener. I really, really like this, especially for summer whenever I just want to do a light kind of, but it's not like completely or anything and I really do like this. I got this in the shade light and let me show you what it looks like. Here's the shade on my skin and if I blend it in, it matches pretty well to my skin. <laughs> I think my hands are a little bit tanner than my face is, so it might not match completely on my hands, but it does on my face and I really like it. This is the lightest shade. I have pretty pale skin, so. Next up, I actually got a free birthday gift from Sephora. I chose the Kosas brow gel and there was a lip oil, but I literally have no idea where I put it. Like, it's around here. I just don't know where it is. It's, she's somewhere, okay? This works really well. I do have it on right now. I don't know if you can look, if you look at my brows, I guess they look lifted up. I don't really use brow gel, but I have been using this and I do like it. Next up, I got a lip liner. I actually like never owned a lip liner or like never really lip liner, but I have been wearing it lately and I really like it. This one's the one from Glossier in the shade Grip. Here's what the shade looks like on my hand. I think it's like a very natural looking lip color, but at the same time, a little bit darker than my actual lips because I like to have like a type lip. Next thing from Sephora is the Tarte Mar Maracuja. I don't know how to say that word, but it's their lip vinyl. I got it in the shade Sheer Lotus, maybe? Yeah, I got it in the shade Sheer Lotus, and here's what it looks like. It looks very pink on the bottle, but it actually is really nice. I really, really like this because you click it up to get the lip product out, and then you can put it on your lips. I find that it lasts a really long time, too. I just put a tiny bit on my hand there, but as you can see, it is pretty pigmented. I really, really like this, and it's not too sticky at all. It is after you first apply it, but I feel like all lip glosses are. I do have a few more makeup products, so let me grab those real quick. Here's my Sephora bag, by the way. I have all my boxes in here. The next thing I got is the Too Faced Lip Injection. I actually did not get this from Sephora. I got it at Kohl's because I got a Kohl's gift card from one of my aunts, and I hadn't really shopped there, but I did find up end up few things so i thought that was cool but i also got the lip injection from too faced i've been wanting this for a while and it was on sale so i thought why not i really wanted a more orangey like lip shade like an orangey corally because i know that it looks definitely really really nice against skin tones but i also like it on mine so yeah i wanted to try it and i do end up really liking it i'm not gonna put it on my lips right now but i will toss it on my hand i got this in the shade I'm not sure if this is the shape, but is it secure the bag? I don't really know what that is. Maybe that's just like a slogan and I'm stupid, but that might be the shade. I don't know. If it's not, I'll put it on screen. Here's the applicator. I really like it. And I did try to put this on yesterday and it burns, which I mean, it's a lip plumping, so it, it should burn. But I was not expecting all that. If you see the little swatch that I did right there, that's what it looks like. It's more of a corally neutral tone and I really like it. It definitely does look really good against my skin as well. The last makeup slash skincare product I got is the Cosrx Snail Mucin thing. I absolutely love Cosrx's products and I did used to have this. I just haven't, I ran out all like a year ago and never repurchased. Here's what the packaging looks like. This is Snail Mucin. It's the Advanced Snail 92 All-in-One Cream. Let me show you what it looks like. I actually haven't opened this yet. Oh my goodness. It kind of smells like paint, I'll be honest, and I'm not going to say what it looks like. 
but yeah it has like a very interesting and sticky texture though i really like this it's very good for moisturizing your skin and i would definitely recommend it that's all for skincare products that's all for skincare and makeup let's move on to clothes i did some shopping and i got this little tank top from H&M. I did find this in the kids section. I find a lot of my things from H&M in the kids section. It's really cute and basic. It's just a white top with a black little trim. I do like it though and I feel like it would go well under like a jacket or a sweater. Speaking of sweaters, I got this crocheted top. I actually haven't tried this on so why don't we right now? My first impression is that- oops, let me- my first impression is that I really like the material and I really like the sleeves as well. They like widen out at the wrist i think that this is super cute and maybe not under over this top just because this top's longer and also you can really see it underneath but i think that this is super cute and definitely really good for fall i don't have any of these like crochet or knits like this so i really wanted to get one and i'm happy that i chose this one it's really comfy and cute i forgot to mention but that crochet sweater was from kohl's and i bought it using my gift card this is also from kohl's i really never shopped there but i did find some cute stuff this being one of them it's this little off the shoulder shirt and I also haven't tried this one on but it looks a little bit big for me so I'm not very hopeful. Anyways, let's just try it on to see how it looks. I'm just gonna put it on over this shirt because I'm lazy. Here's what it looks like. It actually fits me pretty well. I, it looks a bit too big but I don't think it is. It's just loose fitting. This is super duper cute and I don't have an off the shoulder top like this so I think that this is definitely a cute little addition to my wardrobe. You can also wear it like this if you want, which is still cute though I prefer it off the shoulder. This is definitely cute for like a fancier event, you know, it's just like a top, but I really like it. It's also very comfortable. I can't remember if I mentioned it, but this top is also from Kohl's. I always thought of Kohl's to be kind of an old lady store, but I found some cute stuff there so you should check it out. The next thing is also from Kohl's and I got this cute little tie in the front sweater cardigan in black. As you can see, I got a lot of dark clothing just because I feel like my entire wardrobe is pink and white. So I wanted to expand it a little bit. I am just going to immediately put this on because it is so cute and it's so comfortable too. The material is so soft and I probably shouldn't have tried it on against my black shirt. But if you can see, it does tie in the front here and then it's open. This is super duper cute and I can definitely see myself wearing this in like so many different outfits. I really like this top. It's super soft and it's- oh my gosh, it's so cute. I absolutely love making haul videos. They're like my favorite videos to make. Something about just talking about everything I bought just really makes me happy. The last thing that I got from Kohl's is this cute cargo jean skirt. I absolutely love jean skirts and I love cargo pants and cargo skirts so I thought why not get one that's mixed together. I haven't tried this on but by the looks of her she's so cute so let's try it on. Here's what it looks like. I did just try it on right over my shorts. Even though I got a small it is quite big on me which is weird because normally I wear a small to a medium in shorts like a four to a six. But yeah, this is- I mean, it's super duper cute. I love the little things that like hang down. I can think of so many cute outfits to go with this. And I also really like the length. It's not too long, but not too short either. Next up, I have just like one thing from Target, I'm pretty sure. I don't actually remember what I got in here. Ah, uh, yes, I just got a little tank top. I'm not gonna try this on because- okay, look, I'm too late to take off the tank top I'm wearing now. But you can imagine what it looks like. It's just a basic white tank top and it's really cute. I just needed another one of these because I don't know where my last one like this went. I just disappeared. But yeah, she's cute. She's basic. She's a tank top. That's actually all I got from Target. The Target where I went was kind of disappointing. Then I went to H&M and I snagged these little jeans for pretty cheap. They are black and they're very baggy. I really like the way that they look though. I think that they're pretty cute. I'm gonna go ahead and try them on because I haven't yet. I bought these because they're not something that I would normally buy and I really do like them. My only complaint is that they're not very comfortable but they're jeans so what can I say? They are super cute though and I only got them for like $12 they were on sale. I think that's all the clothes I have for now though I do have a few more packages coming after I'm filming this so I'm going to include that at the end of this video. I really just wanted to record this so I can put all this stuff away and don't have to worry about taking it all back out again so I can record this. As soon as my other packages come in the mail, I will be sure to put it in this video at the end. I got two other things from H&M. I got this cute little pearl butterfly necklace. It has a little gold butterfly and then pearls. I feel like this is definitely very my style and I love the pearls with the butterfly. It's super duper cute. Then I got something that was a little like not my style again. I got this red heart necklace. 
I think that it's super cute and it's like very elegant looking in my opinion. I just, I don't know about it, what it is, but I just really like it. And that's all from H&M. I do have one more thing to show you before I can go get my other packages. I bought myself a very pretty Kendra Scott necklace. This is the Blair bow, I believe. It's so cute. Let me show you. It's a cute little bow and it's gold. It's absolutely adorable and I really, really like this. The name is also really nice. I don't know how to describe it, but it's like by really. I don't really know. At Kendra Scott, you do get 50% off for your birthday and I got this with that deal. It's so nice and it's so pretty and I cannot wait to wear it. I do also have some more jewelry and clothes coming in the mail, so like I said, so I will be sure to include that whenever they come. I forgot to include this, but my friend did also get me this little devotion book. It's called Jesus Calling by Sarah Young, and I absolutely love it. I've been reading it every single morning, and it makes me feel so connected to God. I absolutely love this book, and I recommend it to anyone who is a Christian or wanting, wants to learn more about God. She also got me this little My Melody Lego set, which I thought was super duper cute, and I absolutely love it. Like, I can't always hold it. I just haven't yet because I've been busy, but I probably will sometime today or tomorrow. Along with that, she did get me some Victoria's Secret stuff, but it's in my bathroom and honestly, I'm too lazy to go grab it. It's a perfume, a lotion, a body scrub, and a body wash. I'll put the pictures on screen now. I absolutely love it. It's so good and I definitely recommend getting it. And thank you so much to my friend who got me that. It's amazing. Now I will see you whenever my other packages come.